are ghost kitchens for real? Yes, they are. And they're scaring up business opportunities for off-premise dining. Restaurants haunted by the pandemic saw the rise of ghost kitchens. These are operations that are closed to the public and set up for delivery only that is often supported by third-party services. With a smaller footprint and no front of house labor, the potential for lower operating costs is driving momentum. It pays to know what format works best, the ways to get started, the role of technology, how you can grow your business, and the importance of reaching hungry customers. One size doesn't work for every operation, so it's important to choose what works best for your business from these three basic formats. First off is the ghost kitchen. This is an off-site, often shared space with no dine-in seating and delivery or pickup only service. A second format is the host kitchen. Think of it like a restaurant kitchen with a second job. Your existing kitchen can be used to prepare meals for another brand. The third format is the virtual restaurant, where you can create a brand accessible only through online ordering and delivery. Whichever model you choose, launching a ghost kitchen takes a lot of planning. This plan includes asking questions like, does your location have a high density customer base? What are your competitors doing? And can you do it better? Will you deliver your own food or use a third party? And what are your annual cost and profit margin estimates? The bottom line is operating costs can still be expensive and your success will be determined by a strategy that includes plenty of planning. One thing essential to all ghost kitchens is technology. This takes the place of your front of house operation. You'll need technology that's mobile friendly, that makes it easy to place orders, that links your app, website, and social media sites, and secures online payments. Service providers have solutions available, but before plugging into any technology, ask yourself, what are the service fees? How will my data be controlled? Will a service provider promote my business? And does the technology create a seamless experience? During the past year, consumers have grown more comfortable with delivery. This may open the door for using a ghost kitchen to grow your business. You may be able to run more than one concept at a time from your kitchen or at a delivery only location under your brand name. So how do you make it work? The answers are to keep your menu small and cross utilize ingredients. Use limited time offers. Be sure to pay attention to packaging and costs and offer easy add-ons like desserts and beverages. Ultimately, your success may depend on marketing. Getting the word out on social media, promoting your menu, and using mouth-watering images is key. And you can target your efforts to reach the people that are in your prime delivery area. So take the mystery out of ghost kitchens by finding the right format, creating a solid plan, understanding the technology, and the ways you can expand and promote your business. As always, Gordon Food Service is ready with the ideas so you can succeed.